What's up guys, it's Winter, and today I want to go over a little video of the tools that I use on a daily basis of modding. These tools are in not no order, and there will be a download link for these tools in the description below. So let's go ahead and begin. When you download this, you'll get a folder, and you'll get a thank you for downloading, and this is the tools you'll get. First off. Black Ops 2 mod pack. You will get Black Ops 2 menus, Black Ops 2 recovery tools, right here. Card stats, Crimson mods, V8, and Tidalite Dean recovery tool, which I'll go ahead and run in the background. Now, let's go ahead and um, let that load up. Black Ops 2 menus, non GFE, Iron Wolf V2, which is that. Then you, there's how to install. Now, you also got normal GFE, which is all the GFE menus available. This is most of them. Note this menu, this menu, this mod pack of Black Ops 2 was not created by me, but I do use this on a normal basis. Here's the menus that I recommend using, and here's this recovery tool I was talking about. You have connected JTAG, which I am not connected to. Error. You can select your procedures, clean, unlock everything, and test. As is all that. Now, next thing. Black Ops, here's a plugin that's needed. You even have your own launch.ini and a jrpc.ini for the jrpc v2. And you also got Yoda Pro, which I am not going to load up due to being slow. <laughs> Next is my favorite tool. If, no, run. Anyway, which is the GTA 5 100% game in Jerkery 2. I am not signed in. I am not signed in into any um, account, so it will not work. But what it would normally do is that if you was online, signed into a profile, connected to an Xbox Live neighborhood, you'll just click any key and it'll say connecting. It show your gamer tag, profile ID. And it will do a complete game save and make it 100% safe. That's pretty simple. For you, don't want to do the prologue and all of that stuff. And you don't even have to be. You can be on a dashboard for that. Next is for recovery tour for GTA 5. I will go ahead and open this up. It is by him. Connect, but I'm not going to because it's off. And if you clearly see. Not bad. You have set armor. You can even go up more to unlimited. Mine, what I do in recovery is that. And I do that for all of them. Same thing to here and here. And this also works for character 1, character 2, character 3. Not on there. And by the way, guys, when you have these tools, make sure you keep them in the folder like this. Or if you move them to the desktop, move everything to the desktop or it will not work. Next tool is a tool I use on a daily basis. It's the XRPC tool by Xbox 360 best. And this is version 3.0.0. It comes with a change log by fixing box one IP copying and other crap as you can clearly see right there. And oops, here's that tool. Now this is a big tool, free tool. You also got Donate, Gamers, 711's tool, which I recommend looking at. It's pretty decent. Screenshot, X notification, X notification, I guess. I don't know what that is. Test. You can download plugins, Black Ops 1, GFC menu, VFG menu, contact, YouTube, code buttons. And tool. World at War. There's all the stuff for World at War. 
This game is old. Very. Yeah, Black Ops 1 Zombies. Non host, newest one's got mode on non host. And host only on Black Ops 1 Zombies. And now you have Black Ops 1 for the um, online. God mode classes is not $10. So that's how they much they normally are, but they're not. Non host mods, host mods. Free game mods and quit stats on the MW2 basically the same you don't get a lot of non hosts but pre game you get a bunch host only client list get names kick host to MW3 you know go ahead and advance warfare skip towards it ghosts have a bunch of options too like Advanced Warfare. Yeah, pretty good stuff. Black Ops 3. Nothing really too big. Just because the game has cheap protection and Halo Reach. To any rank on Halo Reach. D -re max rank, D rank. He didn't want to waste his time. I wouldn't recommend it wasting time either. And that's it, guys. Um, This link will be in the description for download. Um, Go ahead and give the video a like. And this tools and this pack will be updated. You can also find these on Seven Sins if you have a request to me to add tools into this little pack I'm making. It's not really a pack. It's more like tools I um tools tools that I choose. You no. Know? So yeah, guys, leave a like and I'll talk to you all.